What up? Here we are in lovely South Mountain Reservation. The site of many bodies being found and various abandoned structures strewn about. Recently, Sarah and I took a detour from the polluted Passaic in order to explore the bucolic shores of the Rawway River. Flowing through the 4,000 plus acre South Mountain Reservation, the Rawway's banks are lined with trails that attract hikers from the furthest reaches of the tri-state area. Tourist traps of this nature rarely hold my attention, but there was one lure that I couldn't resist. Walking along the shore of Campbell's Pond, we find the remains of the pumping station which once supplied the city of Orange, New Jersey with drinking water. This brick building has been partially gutted by fire and now serves as a canvas for graffiti writers. Because of its location at the trailhead, the pumping station is heavily visited, but due to the unstable interior, exploration should only be attempted by skilled professionals. The floor of the first room is solid concrete and relatively safe, but the pumping room has been transformed into a death trap. Continuing through the brick arch doorway, we find a scene of violent destruction and I carry on alone. Fire and water have wreaked havoc with the ceiling and eaten away at the wooden floors. To tread here is to take your life in your own hands. Canals full of stagnant, inky water can be seen through holes in the floor, and it is only by carefully stepping from beam to beam that I make it to the back room. Having satisfied my curiosity, I make my way back to Sarah, who is waiting for me on solid ground in the main chamber. We peruse the graffiti as if we were looking at paintings in a museum. Suddenly a noise from outside attracts our attention. I pull Sarah into a corner, hoping we might get the chance to scare someone. As luck would have it, we couldn't have picked a better victim. Same thing as you are, don't worry about it. Stepping outside, we check out the intake tube stretching into the pond and get an idea how the building once operated. Open manholes are abundant and it pays to watch your step while exploring this section of the reservation. Around the back of the pump house, we encounter more spray paint and the base of the giant chimney which happens to have an open blast door. There's not much more to see here, so we goof around in the woods for a while and then call it a day. Repent! Repent! Ah! The fucking mangrove! It's a fucking mangrove! I don't think that's a mangrove. It's a mangrove! Yes, it is! <laughs> Let me out! Let me out!